Hopefully one of his uh, running mates will be with him. We're looking for about four different deer. Fingers crossed. Boy, he's pretty though. He's beautiful. This week we're gonna kick things off with old Jared Mayberry from Drop Time Leases. Now if you're ever in the Midwest and you're in need of a good hunting lease, give this man a call. But this week we're gonna start things off. He's gonna be hunting up in North Missouri on one of his farms. He's got a couple of big bucks on his list. We're gonna see if he can't get it done. We've got a northeast wind right in our face. And we've got a nice two-year-old eight point out in front of us. We've had deer in and out all evening long. And uh, it's getting about that time where these bucks have been showing up. What a brute. I don't know, I felt like I had him at 40, 45 yards there. I'm not sure if I shot right underneath him or what. Well, Jared had a great opportunity there. It just didn't happen. Wasn't able to capitalize on it. It's happened to us all. That's just hunting. But Jared's got a lot of good bucks running in his farm. So he knows if he stays after it, hunts hard, he's still got a pretty good chance to put his tag on a good North Missouri buck. Hoping we can catch one of these shooters coming across this bottom, get him to see the decoy and maybe get curious. Who knows? Yeah, that's him. I've been trying to kill him for freaking years. Yep, here he comes. Okay. He's coming towards the decoy. Okay. <sighs> oh. Man, we've all been there. I'll tell you what, you know, old Jared's doing everything he knows to do. He just hadn't came together yet. But with rifle season right around the corner, he's feeling optimistic that he may get a little redemption. We're proud to let y'all know that Reckland Realty is a duck and buck commander endorsed land broker. Reckland has over 20 licensed land agents and counties. Their agents are foresters, farmers, ranchers, landowners, and business people. They all enjoy hunting, fishing, and the outdoor lifestyle and have the experience to market your land the right way. Willie's right. We have some great land agents who can help you. At Reckland Realty, all we do is land. So give us a call or check us out at reckland.net. Well, you know, despite the rainy conditions, uh, Jared still had a pretty good morning hunt. He's seen a lot of bucks, just not the caliber buck that he's looking to pull the trigger on. 
With that weather rolling out, things are starting to look up. I'll tell you what, it's been an awesome morning so far. I had all these does out, all these bucks chasing does, you know, tending does. Just exactly what you want to see this time of year. It's the 16th of November, so I mean, we are literally in the heart of it. It's a little late this year, so we are in the heart of it. We could see a giant at any minute. You know what? I think that is redemption on the 10 point that I missed with a bow on October the 3rd. I'm pretty sure that's that deer. I'm 99% sure. It looked like him. That is the 10 point that I missed on the 3rd of October. And I missed him with a bow at 40 yards. And here he just, I mean, bam. He's in the middle of the field before we even know it. Yeah. Lord just blessed us right there with a freaking stud 10 point. I mean stud, because he's hammered. Oh uh, yeah. Hammered right in the front shoulder. Didn't even make it to the creek, dead deer. <laughs> Congratulations. That's the one I missed with the bow. What a stud. Ah, oh, he's a gorgeous deer. Just can't believe it. What a morning. One of, one of the better mornings we've had in a long, long time here in here in, uh, in Missouri when it comes to the rough anyway. So, just excellent, excellent buck. Couldn't be any more happy. Gorgeous deer. Congrats, old buddy. That's the way to get her done. I'll tell you what, after a hard season, that's a rewarding buck and a nice buck right there. Uh, now we're gonna switch things up. We're gonna get the tree with old Aaron Young and Cody Kemper and see if they can't get it done. Wow. <laughs> Cody, that was a big one. We're proud to let y'all know that Reckland Realty is a duck and buck commander endorsed land broker. Reckland has over 20 licensed land agents and county. Their agents are foresters, farmers, ranchers, landowners, and business people. They all enjoy hunting, fishing, and the outdoor lifestyle and have the experience to market your land the right way. Willie's right. We have some great land agents who can help you. At Reckland Realty, all we do is land. So give us a call or check us out at reckland.net. <sighs> what a beautiful morning, nice and cold. About 33 degrees. Hopefully we can get one to come by today. We've seen lots of bucks cruising around. Seen a real nice one chasing, so if we can just get him close enough to shoot. I'm pumped up. It's gonna be a good morning.
Wow. Cody, that was a big one. Well, O'Hare and Cody just had an encounter with a great North Missouri buck. You know, they've been hunting hard. They've been up there hunting in North Missouri for quite a while now. The wives are starting to get edgy. You know, they're wanting them home, but they decided after seeing that big buck, they're just gonna take their chances and stay in the tree. He was a nice one. <sighs> yes, baby. <laughs> what do you think about that, buddy? Oh, this deer's dude. gonna be dead. He's not gonna be too far. He's just pouring out blood. Is that over there? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yes. Oh, finally, man. Finally had a shooter come close enough. I mean, we've been working at it hard and we kept seeing some decent ones, but finally these two does came down through there. I was wondering, like, why is there not a buck on them? It's been kind of a weird year and then all of a sudden, Cody goes, Buck, buck, right up there. He came right down through there, perfect. Wow. Congrats, guys. This is a way to stay after her and get her done. I'll tell you what, that just goes to show that, you know, sometimes it happens the very first day you're sitting in the stand. Sometimes it happens the very last day. You just don't know. Sometimes it don't happen at all. But they stayed with it. They were able to get a, you know, get a nice buck on the ground. And on a side note, and a positive note, when they got home, their stuff is all still in the house. We'll see you next week.